The Wimmera, the Mallee and the Grampians are great places to live and work, but we have a problem. The rate of violence against women and girls is unacceptably high and needs addressing immediately. Family violence across the Horsham, Hindmarsh, Yarra and Ararat and Northern Grampian Shire are double or near double the state average. Some of the highest rates of gendered violence in the state are in our part of Western Victoria. So there's new evidence now showing how important it is for men to help find solutions and I think we're all capable of doing that as men where I might have a friend and and then if if I'm helping with the solutions and he's helping then we might have different groups of friends and then it sort of slowly branches out and then we're getting a greater reach and finding better solutions for people to try and stamp out this domestic violence, gendered violence, etc. We know that the way men talk to each other is vitally important, even when women aren't in the room. We know that if there is a culture of disrespect, men in that group or room are more likely to give themselves permission to be violent towards their female partners. This disrespect could be anywhere, an office, the factory floor, the club rooms, the bar or the paddock. If you hear men speaking disrespectfully about the woman, speak up, say something, do something. Let others know that you are not okay with that. It's not okay to put women down. We need to be part of the solution, not the problem. I myself have been guilty in the past of making comments um, towards women, but I'm excited now to try and make change and, and encourage other men to make change, particularly having having daughters. And I recently had a, had a mate who made a comment about a woman and I said, come on, mate, um, that's inappropriate. It's 2024. How would you like it if someone spoke about your daughter like that? So I think if we all can sort of contribute like that, in those subtle ways, then hopefully we can make a greater change. The problem is a problem for women, but it's a man's problem. It's time that we, as men, took responsibility for it. We have the power to make the change that will allow everyone to be safe in the community.